it's me, Sailor. Uh, it's me, Sarah Yornis here, Amara. And today, well, today I'm going to talk about. Oh, what am I going to talk about? So, alright. So, yes, we did get the, uh, the YouTube film shifting tool to work, or at least get it where we have an end sheet at the end of our film, and that is far as we're going to, as far as we're going with it. Beyond that, you're asking way too much of it beyond that. So, today is, uh, well, today I'm going to talk about, you know, this one thing I'm going to talk about. So, I heard that, well, I don't know. All right. So, and this might be on something that's probably even we already talked about. Or we did not talk about. All right. So, the first thing I want to... I want to put out there is that I did talk about this before and I think it probably does need to be talked about many times but all right let's just talk about this so ah, and knowing YouTube is gonna pick that one so the first thing I'm going to talk about here or the thing I am going to talk about today is that all right hell I am going to talk about it why no film shifting or what some folks would call editing but that's a Latin borrowed word first off every tool out there that there is to work with either it be Final Cut or it be Mackie Cam or Sony Vegas or Cyberlink or either it happened to either be ArcSoft or Microsoft or Apple I don't care whatever it happens to be I don't care who made it they're all too hard to work with you know and here is the hardest thing to learn about them is is that when you want to cut something out you're asking way too much from it so all right everyone want here's the truth about what we're talking about today so and Sailor Moon Super or also known as Sailor Moon Over we were called near kin and everyone has this fought and belief over why Cloverway did that someone had a belief that it was Cloverway saying just keep them the way they are well that is more smoothly said and done now keep in mind around that time it was still hit and go or hit and miss there were still folks out there and there probably still are folks out there that felt that it was wrong for a South Hood to be like that. So I guess Cloverway had to come up with some grounds to why they were close. So being near Ken was the only thing they could come up with. Now keep in mind, Cloverway had won the right to work with the third and fourth followings of Sailor Moon about 19, nine between 99 YL. They didn't get, they didn't start doing it, the show didn't air until next year. Pioneer won the rights to do the films. So, anyway, um, but I also believe it had to be Pioneer was doing it too, because at the end of Sailor Moon Super, it would say Cloverway. And well, no, it actually would say Pioneer, depending on which one you watch. So, anyway, um, so Cloverway or Pioneer had to come up with some way to why we were called Nearkin and why we were so close. And I get it. And Toei's offshoot, which everyone else offshoots from, we were, um, same, same love, uh, Ken 
or a team or whatever you want to call it. But at the end of the day, some folks would scape it by saying, why did they even have to say anything like that? Well, keep in mind, Cloverway and Pioneer did not want to get in that same kind of bind that 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 Deke got didn't want to be in. So they could not shift our 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 kind of rounds and we already were women. So the only thing that Pioneer and Cloverway could come up with was to shift them from being near kin. Even though a lot of folks scaped it by saying, hey, that wasn't really a, uh, a smooth uh, shift. And everyone knew what they were going in. But Pioneer Cloverway didn't want someone to, you know, get, get bitchy. Start bitching about how they felt it was wrong for that to be on the Farseer and then get the FCC on them and all other shit. So they didn't want to get in a bad standing with either cartoon at the time they got the deal to air them, got the rights to run them. Two, didn't want any bind of the FCC over it, even though at these, at, even though it's not like how it is now. And keep in mind around this time the rating had come out, the rating oversight had come out, or whatever you want to call it, that law had come out and had been out for at least two or three, had been out from at least one or two for three years by that time. So that may have been also the grounds to why they could do a little bit more than what Deke could do with it. <clears throat> but at the end of the day, I don't know why they went with Nearkin. They could have called them sisters, they they could have called us something, but even if they did that, it still would have been hard for any for it to be sold. And I don't think anyone watching it was sold by that. I think they knew there was a lot more going on with us and Sailor Neptune and Michelle that would make the folks say they are doing more stuff. They are if they're near kin then why are they doing all this hugging or all this kissing or whatever? Which at the end of the day, there wasn't really, we didn't really do that much of it. There wasn't really that much of it going on in Super or Over. Oh yeah, we were always around each other. And there was always, yeah, I was always, you know, but at the end of the day, I don't really think there was a lot of that going on. So it is what it is. Now, am I irked over it or mad? No, I'm not. Why would I be? There's already folks out there that are irked and mad over every shift that Deke had done, every shift that Cloverway and Pioneer have done. And depending to where you watched it at with who did it. So, Nearkin, I don't really know if that was was a good thing to do but keep in mind even if they were even Cloverway and Pioneer didn't want to be in a bind of anyone over that so they had to come up with some grounds to why we were close but I don't know if if Nearkin was the right way to go now keep in mind, I don't have any hang up with it. I don't think it was wrong or anything. But some folks out there be like, oh, well, why would it be that? Well, I guess Pioneer and Cloverway didn't want to come right out and say, yeah, they're the same kind, love. It's same kind lovers or whatever you want to call it. It's not a big deal now. But back then, it still was kind of a big deal that even Pioneer and Cloverway didn't want to didn't want to get into it. So anyway, yeah, just talking about how how me and Sailor Neptune Michelle how we were called near kin by Pioneer and Cloverway. Um, that's it. I'm Sarah Yornis Amara. Hope you like this film.